I was blessed to work for the best community in the country from day one. Never wanted to go anywhere else. Never wanted to go to the city. Had a chance to go there once. Didn't want to go there. Uh, Chief Stewart was instrumental in opening up those avenues, and he said, what do you want to do? I'll help you. I said, oh, I'm a hop in the boy. I want to stay here. And I used the saying, sometimes when you cut me, I bleed green. So it's like uh, it's been installed in me from an early age, the team aspect, through the sports in high school. Uh, and I was able to, in, to be involved with the best team in the world. You know what I mean? When if anything that goes on, there isn't any other people in town that I would rather do anything that we had to deal with here, whether it would be in someone's home, at a fire, on the highways. And, uh, and they always brought their A games and made me proud and hopefully made the community proud of the job that we do and uh, what we try to do each and every day out in the street. I'm going to be brief. Thank you very much. It's like uh, been a great run. Thank you. First of all, I'd like to uh, say it's an honor to uh, follow uh, Chief Clark. Um, he's been one of my great mentors over the years. I've been here in Oxford, so hey, thank you very much. I'm trying to put a few words together, and there's only two words that uh, that come to my mind. I, as you all know, I probably have a lot of words, but the two uh, foremost are uh, thank you. Uh, first of all, thank you to my family. Um, I'm sure a lot of people can tell you it's tough being married to a cop. You know. Um, you miss a lot of uh, events in their family, and hopefully now that I'm going to re be retiring shortly, I can uh, make up those, uh, those missed times. I also want to thank the Board of Selectmen and, and all the townspeople. Um, I came here 30 years ago, and uh, I was still kind of green. Um, I was here for about 15 minutes, and I said, I'm going to make a home here. Um, you know, I was honored and blessed to be uh, working with some great members of the police department who are true friends of mine. They were great mentors. They helped me uh, come uh, grow up from a, uh, a free auxiliary police officer in the uh, late 70s all the way up to uh, interim police chief. Uh, without those great members uh, or mentors and supporters, I wouldn't have been able to do that. So I want to thank the Board of Selectmen, all my friends and family on the blue team, as well as all the community people that have stood by me and supported me over the years. So again, thank you to all of you. I appreciate it. First of all, I want to thank the selectmen for all their kind words. And I'd like to thank the community for allowing me to serve them for the 26 years, eight months, and eight days. <laughs> I've had a great ride. I've been involved very much with the community. My heart is always with Hopkinton. Born and brought up here, and especially to the community and the people that I've worked with over the years. They've been great. Couldn't do it without them. And I'm going to miss it. And I want to thank you. Thank the Board of Selectmen. Thank Norman, Maria, and the community, and all my friends here tonight. Thank you. It's true, it's like as Maureen said, I. It's the community that I love, and I'll always want to serve the community any, any way that I can. And, yeah, I spent most of my tenure with the Board of Selectmen, and I served under every single person here except for John. You were, but you were the other day I got from the housewife, so that was really cool. Um, and Mr. Kamalo, uh, it's been a pleasure working with you, and I'm glad to see you. I remember being here in this room when you were interviewed, and um, you were definitely my number one choice, just to know, yeah. Uh, I, H. Cam, I love you guys. Uh, everybody here, I think, I just know just about everyone here, I, the police department, wicked awesome in working with them through the years. Uh, fire department and uh, DPW, actually. Um, Sarah from the Independent, I, um, I, you know, you hate missing anybody. I mean, there's people out right here in the hall. I love all of you. I will see you on the trail. I'm going to build a big nest, and we're all going to nest in there, and we're going to have fun. Take a nap when we need to, okay? And Bob, thank you so much for all your support, Joe. So thank you. I appreciate this greatly. I'll see you around.